welcome students in a series of geometrical shapes today's topic is quadrilateral a quadrilateral is a polygon made up of four sides just see here this is a square it is also a quadrilateral it is a rectangle a quadrilateral it is a parallelogram it is a trapezoid and is a rhombus these are some examples of quadrilaterals let us see first basic quadrilateral that is square all four sides are equal and all the angles are right angle in square just see here this is a b c d and these are right angles of 90 degree angle a angle b angle c angle d all are right angles and all four sides are equal so we can say that ab equals to bc equal to cd equal to da in square and if we will observe we can find that side ab is parallel to side cd and side ad is parallel to side cb in a similar way because of this right angle we can say that ad is perpendicular on ab and bc is perpendicular on ab in a same way we can say that ad is perpendicular on dc and bc is perpendicular on cd all of you are aware with rectangle it is also a quadrilateral in rectangle opposite sides are equal and all are right angle let like just like this it is a rectangle and in this rectangle a b c d we can find that all angles are of 90 degree it means they are right angle and opposite sides are equal here like ad equal to bc ab equal to cd and we can say that ab is parallel to cd and ad is parallel to cb in a same way just like a square we can say that ad is perpendicular on ab bc is perpendicular on ab ad is perpendicular on dc bc is perpendicular on cd another kind of quadrilateral is this it is a parallelogram opposite sides are equal in parallelogram as well as they are parallel to just see here in this parallelogram abcd we can find that opposite sides are equal it means ad equal to bc as well as ab equal to cd and they are parallel to each other also it means ab is parallel to cd and ad is parallel to cb here angle a equals to angle c and angle b equals to angle d also next type of quadrilateral is this where two sides are parallel it is trapezoid just like this just observe here we can find that side ab is parallel to side cd next is rhombus where all four sides are equal and opposite sides are parallel in rhombus but there is one basic difference between rhombus and a square which is the angle it is not necessary that angles in rhombus are right angle so here we can say ab equal to bc equal to cd equals to da just like a square and ab is parallel to cd ad is parallel to cb but here angles are not right angle so it is rhombus so in mathematics what you need to do yes practice because practice makes 
perfect. So do practice.